Today, the talk is going to be on the feet. This is a very good, it's not a symbol, but a mystery. The whole body is a mystery. The first commune is the body, how we all dance with each other. You remember the symbol of the Ark of Noah, and God told him, male and female, yin yang, which is this energy, yin and yang. So this science is called oriental diagnosis. By looking at each other, by looking at your face in the mirror, by looking at your hand, you can read so much. It's wet, it's dry. So this book, just read any page of it. Start with this one. Then you know your body. You look at each other and you know it. Because the body talks, not only walks. The body walks the talk. And the body doesn't lie. So I had a pair of shoes and it just, you know, I had it for years. And I wanted to go and just buy another one. And, and I bought the so-called most expensive. I came home. And I threw the other one with thank you. And I couldn't give it away because it was very old, so-called. Right. But I had pain. I went the next day. I kept this because I walked like 10 minutes. And I bought three pairs. Very expensive. Different marks. And, and again, pain. More in my back and the feet. I went to medical shoes. Dr. Scholl or others. And the same. So on the internet, I started looking. And I asked a friend of mine who is a great oriental diagnosis. He said, Yes, conspiracy. All the shoes in the Arab world, mainly for the Muslims, are hurting the feet. What for? Just read this and see. What they do. You know, like 50 years ago, you make custom made. They take the size of the shoes and the, your feet and they do the shoes and so the clothes but now ooh, all sizes one size for all and this one protruding ball of the foot this one man or woman mainly in the woman you know she will be a widow read this and you know your future you know your past and now and the future and then you know what happens when the shoes are not you know comfortable and and who was the first to make this the story of the king who said put leather on all this uh, kingdom and the man said why we put leather you know under your feet and then you can walk and this is how the shoe came. The shoes are the body. How they touch all the meridians. You know, you have good luck or bad luck. What is this meridian for? Just read it. And I couldn't find a healthy pair of shoes in Lebanon. I went to Dubai, it's the same, all the Arabs. Arabs don't read, so we don't know what they are doing. They hacker us. They said, okay, the Arabs, they don't read. So if they wear shoes like this, they become more sick and more medication and more hospitals and more money to the FDA of America and Israel. So they kill each other and they kill us. We are the cause. It's not America. It's not Israel. Each one of us is responsible. I cannot clean the house of my neighbor. You will see the house where I am living. It's the dirtiest neighborhood, the dirtiest building, and the people are very rich in the building, and nobody talks with anybody. They all run out, run out, and more or more are running. And then when you come to my home, it's our home. So simple, so poor, and so rich. You have all what you need. 
not what you greed. Few books and this is all. This book is about the skin, hands, all your body. So what happened? So today I couldn't go to find another shoes and the pain here. So I had to put all this, you know, I couldn't wear any shoes without the socks and look what's going on. No healing shoes, no good shoes, so I have to go barefoot wearing only socks, waiting for a friend of mine to send me a pair of shoes from London or the States or maybe when I go to India. So why are we doing this to each other? Because we don't know, we are ignorant. Hi here, walking. Do you know what happens when you do this? Mainly for the women who are pregnant. What's going on with the baby? They don't know. They don't care. So if you look at all this one, without this feet, you cannot go and walk. This is the only car the best car that you have. So always, every day, as much as you can, touch all the body with your hands and let the river of the energy of the power river in.